Hello lovely people and welcome to London Diaries with Shika. So today's video is all about Marc Jacobs matte highliner eyeliner. I have received a couple of them courtesy of Marc Jacobs Beauty and Influencer and this is what I am testing out and reviewing for today's video. If you're curious to find out my views, then please keep on watching. All right, first things first. Now, Influencer is like a website or an app that anyone can register to. You know, you don't need to be a YouTuber to register on to Influencer. As long as you have your social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, you can register, you can participate in campaigns, you can review products over there. And you will, you know, if selected, receive products for testing just like I am. Um, I'm going to link the details down below in the description box if you're interested. So this is the box I received. Um, it was delivered by Royal Mail and I think I've had it for like a week or so. Um, if I open it, as I'm really good in opening boxes, it comes with this template. And then the two eyeliners which I've received. Now the pamphlet is um, basically trying to tell you what all can be achieved from these gel eye crayons, you know, whether you want to use it for lining your eyes or you want to use it as an eyeshadow or for your waterline. So that's what this pamphlet is about. Now the first thing that I'm going to do before we move any further is read what Marc Jacobs website has to say about these eyeliners. Now they retail for 19 pounds and the quantity is 0.5 G. So this is what Marc Jacobs say. Experience the intense color payoff, amazing glide and 12 hour long wear of Marc Jacob Beauty's original award winning highliner gel eye crayon eyeliner re-envisioned in a bold matte finish. The pure hues are glitter-free, intensified by super-rich pigment, unlike other eye pencils. This malleable formula glides on smoothly for precise application and gives you 15 seconds of playtime before it sets in place for wear that lasts all day, making it ideal for creating versatile eye looks. I will be inserting a clip of me using these eyeliners, but just to show you the shades I've received. Now, I have received two shades of pink. Uh, they must know how much I love pink. First one is popular. It's a darker shade of pink, and this is the shade swatched on the back of my hand. And the next one that I have received is Pink of Me. Like, Pink of Me. Um, it's a lighter shade of pink. Here you see it. And let's swatch it. They are super smooth to work with. So this is so light, it can classify just, you know, as close to white. Uh, now I'm going to, oops, where's? All right, now I'm going to insert a clip of me using these. Okay, I'm going to use popular on top of my eyelid, um, on top of the eyeliner, a black eyeliner, and I'm going to use pink of me in my lower waterline and to highlight my brow bone. So let's have a look at those clips. Hello, lovely people, and welcome to London Diaries with Shika. So today's video is all about Marc Jacobs matte highliner eyeliner. I have received a couple of them courtesy of Marc Jacobs Beauty and Influencer. And this is what I am testing out and reviewing for today's video. If you're curious to find out my views, then please keep on watching. All right, first things first. Now, Influencer is like a website or an app that anyone can register to, you know, you don't need to be a YouTuber to register on to Influencer. As long as you have your social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, you can register, you can participate in campaigns, you can review products over there. 
and you will, you know, if selected, receive products for testing just like I am. Um, I'm going to link the details down below in the description box if you're interested. So this is the box I received. Um, it was delivered by Royal Mail and I think I've had it for like a week or so. Um, if I open it, as I'm really good in opening boxes, it comes with this template and then the two eyeliners which I've received. Now the pamphlet is um, basically trying to tell you what all can be achieved from these gel eye crayons, you know, whether you want to use it for lining your eyes or pink, but I wouldn't have necessarily drawn towards purchasing pink eyeliners. So I'm really, really thankful that I received them in the post so I could try it on and get out of my comfort zone because um, if I have to go back and purchase a gel highliner, I'd probably go for like a more navy blue kind of a shade or a purple kind of a shade, like something dark. Not, I wouldn't be, you know, too brave to try this pink out. So that's why I'm really glad that this is the shades I received because I could experiment with my regular looks that I do. Um, and who knows, maybe I go and get like a aqua blue color tomorrow and try that out. Um, I would say these are really good quality eyeliners and I haven't uh, yet tried them as an eyeshadow so I don't know how that would work. Um, in future I will be trying this one as an eyeshadow and I will let you know how it went for me so I think that's it for today's video. Alright guys, so that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, then please do leave them in the comment section down below. And until next time, please keep smiling. Eyeshadow. Really? You know, sometimes when you forget how to record. Like always, come on. As long as you have your shirt, social, social. Well, we're gonna get through this, aren't we? Damn, that's what's happening with me.